So there's going to be another one at A. So they're all parallel. So I just need to do the needful. I slide in it to A here. So I have all my lines that are vertical, I have them already. You can see that. So you can take out any extra lines that may cause confusion or not in the drawing. Like this line I'm taking out. Now there's a line here I'm taking out that's not there. And that. Now we'll move to the next step of knowing the height of this. What's the length of A, uh, G, H, I, J, let's call this K. What's the height of A, K? The measurement of A, K is 15 mm. That is 1.5 centimeter on your centimeter rule so this is it and then at k f k f line k f is parallel to line a uh, g so what i just need to do is to draw parallel lines to it simple so parallel line procedure place your set square and then your ruler then you slide all through to the point and draw that so this is um k and this is uh, F. Now F I is parallel to F I is parallel to B E. You see that, and it's also parallel to K J. So all you just need to do is this is the line I want to make uh, another line parallel to. Place my set square there, the longest part of my set square, and uh, my ruler right behind. Then I slide up to the point. That is a uh, F I gotten point I and I'm taking it up to K uh, to get K J. You see that? So uh, the last line which is I J or J I I J J I. Okay, so uh, it's parallel to K F. So I'll place my set square on K F and then put my rule on the other end of the set square. I slide it up to I and i get to draw the line so this is i and this is j you can take out every extra line this is the required block so you can then outline what you have you can see that this is what is expected of course So you can outline, just keep outlining the main lines and then erasing the old line. So this principle works for every kind of isometric, even for some irregular uh, kind of blocks with curves and uh, with uh, tilted edges and the rest. The basics, they all follow the same basic using parallel lines that are 30 degree to the horizontal so this is it 30 degree 30 degree thank you